When your Xfinity remote stops responding to voice commands, there are several common causes and straightforward solutions to try. The most frequent culprits are low batteries, weak Wi-Fi connections, blocked microphones, and temporary system glitches. Start with the most common fix, replacing the batteries. Remove the battery cover, insert fresh AA batteries with correct polarity, and check for any corrosion in the compartment. Next, perform a complete power cycle. Unplug both your TV and Xfinity box, remove the remote batteries, wait 60 seconds, then plug everything back in and reinsert the batteries. Check the microphone opening on your remote. Use a soft, dry cloth to gently clean around the microphone area, removing any dust or debris that might block voice detection. If these basic troubleshooting steps don't resolve the voice command issues, the next step is to repair your remote with your TV box, which varies depending on your specific remote model. When basic troubleshooting doesn't resolve voice command issues, repairing your remote is the next crucial step. The process varies depending on your specific remote model. First, identify your remote model. The XR11 has a setup button, the XR15 is a voice remote without a setup button, and the XR16 is a voice remote without number buttons. For XR11 remotes with a setup button, hold the setup button until the light turns green, then press the Xfinity button and follow the on-screen instructions that appear on your TV. For XR15 voice remotes without a setup button, press and hold both the Xfinity and Info buttons together until the light turns green, then enter the three-digit pairing code displayed on your TV screen. For XR16 voice remotes without number buttons, simply aim the remote at your TV box, press the microphone or voice button, and follow the on-screen prompts that guide you through the pairing process. If repairing doesn't resolve the issue, check your voice control settings. Navigate to Settings, then Remote Settings, then Voice Control, and ensure it's enabled. For persistent problems, the Xfinity app can serve as a reliable backup remote. It provides full remote functionality, including voice commands, and works while you troubleshoot your physical remote. If all troubleshooting and repairing attempts fail, contact Xfinity support for further assistance. They can provide additional troubleshooting steps or arrange for a remote replacement if your hardware is defective.